You're watching East Texas Live. Hey, welcome back to East Texas Live. Joining me in studio, Lindsay Fronberger and Amber Verona, and they're here talking about downtown Tyler, making it a destination. You guys have some upcoming events. Uh, a lot of people are interested in hanging out downtown. Why should they go? Yes, yeah, so one of the things that we're having coming up on September 9th is our Downtown Tyler Arts Festival. This is actually our second year doing this, and we are thrilled because last year we only had 40 vendors. This year we're already up to 85, and we still have a whole week left for vendors to apply. So that's really kind of what we wanted to talk about of allowing vendors and artists to know that they can still apply and so if they go to our website at downtowntyler.org they can simply see the application or visit our Facebook. So what kind of artists are you looking for? Any type of artist that's what we love about the term art it can range from drawing on a canvas to the art of photography or creating something with your hands and so right now we have such a wide variety of artists where it comes um, through the art of food through painting to anything so we really want to invite our art community to come and participate but also the public to come out and view it all right tell me about the film festival in downtown Tyler yeah so this is actually part of the film uh, the Tyler Art Festival as well we're partnering with them it's actually a three-day ordeal uh, so that's Thursday Friday and Saturday so one of its young filmmakers um, everywhere else so it's international as well and then it's Texas shorts and uh, award ceremony so that's all at our historic theater Liberty Hall in downtown right you can purchase individual day tickets or there's a three-day pass so it's really an awesome thing that you can come downtown visit some of the arts that's on the square but also Liberty Hall and visit some of the downtown businesses that are open you know that sounds adorable because my 11 year old daughter has started making videos it started for TikTok, yeah. but now they keep getting longer right yeah uh, is there a category for her so the young filmmakers so I believe there is an age limit but with the permission of uh, some of the adults they can apply the applications are over they're now showing the winners of each category so she would probably love the film uh, the the young filmmaker ones and that's on a Thursday all right so let's talk about hit the bricks what is hit the bricks yeah so you want so to hit the bricks is a way to promote events and things happening every second Saturday in downtown Tyler um, so we promote our, what the things that our downtown businesses are doing and also any events that are happening so uh, second Saturday of this month is actually this upcoming Saturday and um, we have the Goodman the Goodman Legrand Museum um, open and also we have the Rose City Farmers Market as well um, that is happening on the kind of forward part of uh, the porch at East Texas Brewing so that's a really great way for people to come out and enjoy local um, produce and be with their community. Oh, you got me out there with the brewing. You know, <laughs> right. really yeah. All right, well, thank you very much, Amber and Lindsay. And again, if you want more information on any of the events that are going on in downtown Tyler, pretty easy to remember the website downtowntyler.org. That's it. Thank you, ladies. Thank, thank you. you.